Hello viewer from YouTube, you're about to watch an extract from my Work Faster with InDesign course, which as you would imagine is a course that will get you working faster with InDesign. So I hope you enjoy the video. If you want to watch the whole thing, then you can access it by clicking the link below. What you're seeing me do now is one of the best tricks in InDesign. It's the ability to turn all the guides, all the extra visual stuff on and off with a single click. And as you can see, I am hitting the W key. W on its own, not Command W, not Alt W, just W on its own. So that hides all the extra visual elements that won't print. So hidden characters, guides, grids, margins, all that kind of stuff. So that's wonderful. At least it's wonderful in this context because notice I'm using my selection tool. So W works fine. Let's go back into our previous context. Let's say we are in, oops, we're in here. And I think, oh, what does that look like without the grids? When I hit W and you know what's coming, I know we get a W. Now this happens an awful lot. It may have happened to you already. Um, I don't think I've ever sent something to print with an extra W in it, but lots of people have. So the way you avoid it is you use the shortcut you learned a few minutes ago or a few seconds ago, which is if you're editing text, Hit the escape key, top left, your keyboard, and now you're using the selection tool, so you're not editing text, so you can hit W without worrying. So if this is new to you, my suggestion is very strongly that you always hit the escape key before you use any of these single key shortcuts. Okay, so hit the escape key and then you can use W. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you want to see other videos on the same theme, they're in this same playlist. If you want to watch the whole course, you can click on the link below to access that. And of course, if you want to subscribe and like, then that would be great.